So this weekend is my favorite week of the year. This is Hornet Power Christmas Camp. Okay, here we go. Gather around the board. But that's okay. What we do at Hornet Power Christmas Camp is we bring in all of the Hornets from around the world. We all come together and we just shoot bows, we learn, and it's a camp, but it's not a camp like other camps you might have been to because most of the people here, they already know how to shoot. They shoot really well, so we just look for small improvements and things to make. So the way it runs, instead of having every second scripted all the time, we let everybody shoot, they pull each other into matches, they hang out, they get to know each other better, they have fun. But then someone will ask a question in the middle of what we're doing and then I'll stop the room and say, the question is, how do I get my fingers to do whatever? And then I give a few minutes to make sure that everybody has a full understanding of what that good question might have been. And then I let them go back to work. Uh, this year we had Joel Turner from Shot IQ come in and he and his son Bodie and he did a controlled shot process for the camp and I've used it myself to improve my score so I thought it would be great to bring him in and have him uh, work with the camp and uh, it was fantastic. We had an awesome good time. So we shoot, we shot a score at the very beginning to just set a baseline. Then we did a lot of learning for three days. And now, going on behind me over here, we have the final exam. We had this huge, fantastic shoot off that is bigger than any shoot off would ever be for real, like in your face. We got smoke, lasers. Well, I'm gonna stick a microphone in their face. It kind of looks something like this. So, uh, are you nervous? Right? And uh, we'll do that so that they're prepared. When they go to Lancaster and they have to stand on the stage and shoot there, when they go to Nîmes and they get under the lights, any of these big world archery finals, they know what it's like and they've already endured much worse than what they would do to them in a real tournament environment. So they're ready. I'm excited to see how this goes.